my god. Good. Good. God. Well, folks, I don't know if you've heard the news about this, but uh, apparently Dennis Rodman apparently is still <clears throat> is still defending North Korea again. I yes, yes. Yes, he's still doing it. Yes, he won't shut up about it. Yes, they haven't called... Yes, they haven't called the men in white coats and they haven't dragged the mass off to a mental asylum and put them out of all of our misery. Yes, I know. You want to know what he said? Tough shit. I'm going to say it anyway. Apparently, what he said was, <laughs> was that it, that he's been was been a record six times since last year. <coughs> uh, six times has are are. I realize, in light of what has happened with the NSA, has has Homeland Security really become that lax? Has it six times to 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 North Korea? No, North Korea. That I don't think needs any words. No. Doesn't need any words that needs to be said about them. Six. Mind you, I think considering the fact that we've all seen videos of him and other NBA players singing happy birthday, which I think was the tipping point of, of his mental state, I don't think he can be trusted. But let's move on. He, he describes it, and I'm reading this from BuzzFeed, as nothing you have ever seen over here, not even close. Um, really, some of the survivors have, have described plenty of horror stories over here. They have described a lot of horror stories. <clears throat> a lot. But he says, and I'm quoting this from the article, these are, these, are the, these are from his words on the article on BuzzFeed.com. He says that in his first three visits, it felt, lot, it felt like The Walking Dead, which I haven't watched, mind you. But when, but when he noticed the subsequent, twi the subsequent trips, the city suddenly felt more vibrant. New buildings are popping up, and he's building all the condos and hotel. <laughs> and hotel. And these ho I'm sorry. I'm sorry, folks. But I'm wondering. But I. But this is only proving once more that that that, that the guy is not well. He even claims that he built the biggest, largest water park in the world. I mean, I I could go on over and say everything else, but I'm not going to. Because the point is, Dennis Rodman is not well. He's not. He is clearly not mentally well. Whatever fascination he has with North Korea, or at the least, with Kim Jong Un is unhealthy, and uh, and he should at least be admitted to a mental facility 
before something before and I think it's best before I finish that sentence I should at least stop there for the sake of everybody who who is watching this on YouTube. Uh.